Hello my lovelies, this is Leanne from Resin Shine Creations and welcome to my channel. I hope you are all doing well. In today's video I have this round MDF board and I'll be creating a tropical island with palms and blue sea. I have already prepared the board by painting it with white gesso and I draw a rough sketch of the island how I would like to uh, be and here I am trying out a new technique for me uh, which is basically trying to save some materials by using foil and uh, building up the base and after I'm happy with that I'm gonna use also PVA glue to glue it down so it stays in a place and after that I will go over with sculptor mold and um, cover it so it looks like an island. Right, this is a couple days later, the sculptor mold has dried and now I go over the next step which is applying sand. So basically I just go over with PVA glue and then sprinkle over my white beautiful sand. And after of course let it dry another couple of days and if necessary I always can apply more by spraying some glue on top and then again going over with the sand. So now my sand is ready and next step I'm going to be doing the painting. So I'm gonna paint my board and paint my island in colors so I'm starting by this light sandy uh, color I basically took some uh, acrylic paint and really water it down so it's really thin and light and paints really well and after that I do paint my uh, seabed with blues
So now we go to the exciting bits and this is uh, my palm trees and I'll be using uh, my Dremel to drill holes and uh, apply uh, as many palm trees as I can to this island. And uh, just a little info for backstory, I did have a picture which I was following to create this piece and um, I think always for these kind of projects you need to have some picture of reference so you can uh, follow the details and the colors so it looks more realistic. So all that is finished, here are all my palm trees uh, in a place and now I'm gonna move on to making the sea by using resin. And the picture, in the picture the water was really calm so I thought not to make waves in this piece and I did end up by pouring three layers of resin only because I think the island was too high and then I wanted to bit more incorporate in the sea so it doesn't stick out so much. I do enjoy using two shades for these kind of projects uh, and I don't particularly try to blend them together because I think C always have this uh, kind of uh, multiple colors with uh, easy tones changing.
and that's basically it just pop the bubbles and let it cure after I decided to add the final touches and here it is the island already it looks really cute from the top maybe one thing that I would like is the palm trees were even smaller because they are about five seven centimeters tall but overall I'm very happy with this project how it turned out So if you found this video useful and entertaining, please let me know by leaving comment down below. But for now, I'm saying goodbye. Until next time, keep creating. Bye.